He's a seven-time NBA All-Star. He started his career right here in Toronto with the Raptors. Number one, Tracy McGrady. Tracy for steals and McGrady's assists. on his knees. Is jumping against T-Mac. Now that about makes it fair, doesn't it? And we got to check T-Mac's passport because he's playing for Canada. An early long. Oh, there's your guy. Well, I don't want to say that I picked Jason Sudeikis, but I did. And I had some pretty good intel. Wow. Three nothing, USA right out of the box here. Drew. Goes glass from the top. So he's been watching a lot of video of uh, Chris Paul and Steph Curry. He's Tracy McGrady. Coming up short. Big. That's a travel, ref. Galadon for three. T Mac controlling the rebound. Sudeik is still looking for it. Raunick. Willis Raunick, the Canadian tennis star, with the first bucket of the yes. ball game for T Mac. Semifinals. Semifinals Australian Open this year. Yes. Made a nice run. Uh, that's pretty hard to do with the four great players that we have uh, in men's tennis. Tough to crack that. He did a great job. Yeah, Raunick is a regular person at Toronto Raptors games. Something Brown missing the jump in. Tracy McGrady getting off the floor a little bit, and I say a little bit in quotation. Yeah, back to yeah. back. <laughs> I'm not sure. T Mac queuing up the three. All right, Tracy, this is not an NBA game here, but talk to Stephon James, uh, his, who's playing uh, the role uh, opposite of Jason Sudeikis. What a great guy is McGrady. Remember when he did that in the real All Star yes. game? Threw it down. That was incredible. Tracy McGrady, one of the greats scores ever in the NBA. He was 6'3", he was going to pursue college basketball, but he only ended up 6'2". Okay. So he sings now. Well, I tell you what, it works out for him, and there are a lot of people and eyeballs watching in China right now. Oh, nice game. catch and finish. Now there's a sleeper pick if you want one. Milos Raunin. Good Great size. reach, yeah, 6'5". He's got to have a monster serve, right? Yeah. Six one of the fastest five. ones on the men's tour. I would imagine. Multi Bogues, a little yo-yo move. Draws the foul on the play, and we have our first foul. <laughs> T-Mac gives him a ride into the front row. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. <laughs> Lose the headband. It's a bad image for the United States of America. Yes, sir. Yeah. Tricky Ricky. Well, Canada's got its power lineup in with McGrady and Fox and Sutton Brown all in at the same time. And Butler, who's Three leading, pros. But Butler's leading the, leading the game in scoring. Grady misfiring on another three. Straight out of Compton. Ice Cube Sun. Tracy McGrady with the easy putback. Just taunting Chauncey Billups like that. And belated con congratulations to Chauncey Billups, the Detroit Pistons, retiring his jersey a couple of days ago in Detroit. O'Shea Jackson, a little heat check. Looking for a foul on Wynn Butler. Won't get it. Jackson, like his dad, a huge Lakers fan. Grady going to work on Muggsy Bose. Big, big mismatch here. Yeah, Muggsy says, yeah, give it back to him. He doesn't want any help on defense, JB. Uh, great, great defense by Muggsy Bose. Oh, they called the foul. Oh, you're kidding me. Tracy McGrady, of course, broke into the NBA with the Toronto Raptors right here in Toronto. As an 18-year-old, right out of high school. In constant motion on the sidelines. Rick Fox working down low and gets it to go. Rick Fox, former member of the Canadian national team. University of North Carolina. Sudeikis, that time missing. Moore couldn't get the follow. T-Mac get a T-1 up. Okay, Whoa. JP, at what point do you tell... You guys played together, right? Uh, we'll get back to that in, in just a bit. Let's go to Cassidy Look courtside Ke Kevin with Hart one half of the Splash Brothers. Cassidy? Yep, I'm here with two-time All-Star Clay Thompson, who will also be competing in your second straight three-point contest. So how badly... Okay, so that was, that was real special to hear. Well, good luck and have a great rest of the weekend. All right, thank you. Back to you, Mark. All right, Cassidy. T-Mac has been really cold speaking of three-point shooting from downtown uh, jb at what point do you, do you tell your former teammate that he's, he's got to put the chill jumper out. on chill nine field goal attempts 
zero for five from downtown. Cannon with the lead when we come back to Rico Coliseum. I just want to say that right now I'm doing an amazing job coaching. Puppy, monkey, and baby <laughs> taking in the action courtside. 4.05 to go in the first half. Raunick oh. tried to ace that jumper and missed by a mile. t max still trying to get on the board. Or actually, he's got a nice assist game right there to Chris Wu, who couldn't quite get it to fall. t max actually has seven points. Missed a lot of his three-pointers. <laughs> you know, we had Robert Perra, the owner of the Grizzlies, representing the owners last year. He did a nice job. That's good, though. That's the play, Chauncey. That's good. Way to run the offense. Uh, Kevin Hart getting in touch with his inner Popovich. T-Mac wrestling for the ball and a jump ball called. Semifinals this year, the Australian Open with another bucket. Anthony Anderson missing from close range. Got ripped by McGrady. Tried to foul him and couldn't. Ronich looked like he wanted to lob it up for T-Mac, but he didn't want to hear any of that. T-Mac's got 11 <laughs> field goal attempts, nine boards. I mean, he, he might be going triple-double here. Oh, oh, on, Kevin Hart finding no answers right now. And his team transition defense has been deplorable. O'Shea Jackson, great ball movement by USA, and Tracy McGrady spoils the party. Ronich. Oh, oh, he goes for the slam. There we go. There's we our gotta, first one. Yeah, we got to go all the way back to Terrell Owens, I think. <laughs> He's the only guy I can remember, yeah. remember dunking in a celebrity game. So, Those two guys have kept his team in it, and somebody needs to tell Trace and Grady to relax. <laughs> it's not a true NBA All-Star game. 11 shot attempts for T-Mac. Yeah, his arm's hurting from all the Jays he has been jacking here in the first half. But, hey, you know what? He broke into the league here. He's got a green light to shoot whenever he wants. T-Mac. One of the leaders, he along with Butler, nine points each. Instead, deferring to O'Shea Jackson. Look at that, Kevin Hart. Where is he going? Is he, is he raising the white flag already? He's running out on his team. Literally. Unbelievable oh God, scene God. developing behind the scenes, deep within the bowels of the Rico Coliseum here in Toronto. Kevin Hart, who left his team a moment ago, abandoning them from the sidelines, getting dressed in the locker room and doing what JB he said he'd never do before. He said he was done after his fourth MVP. But look at what's on your screen now. Is it Willis Reed? Look at this. The Rocky music for the fourth time MVP. He simply couldn't take it anymore. <laughs> Donning the uniform one more time. Is he on the active list though? This is a technical foul. He wasn't on the roster. Hey, that's an important right now. <laughs> oh man, it's amazing. It's definitely up there. You know, obviously it's not bigger than the championship, you know, but to be an all-star is just a testament to the hard work you know, that I put in and to see it pay off and brush some brush a few things up and see if I can win that. I do I do have a guarantee to make. One of us big men is winning it, for sure. Oh, for real. Front court strong. But you can't have Boogie and Anthony Davis beat you, though. So does that mean you're calling a guarantee for yourself? Well, you know, I mean, all the guys in it are skilled, you know. So I'm going to try to do what I do. I can't guarantee that I'm going to win. I'm going to guarantee that one of us is going to win. Okay, well, what about your Splash Brothers? They're going up. We had a Twitter poll about who's the best-dressed player in the NBA. But I have to do, a, a, you know, an award ceremony here question. Who are you wearing right now, Draymond? Uh, you know, I got... Look at this pass. Roundage. Got an easy He's one. He's played well, too. Yeah. Remember the, the dunk? He's got 10 points. Good look there by McGrady. You mentioned his dunk. We forgot to mention J. Cole actually had a dunk in a oh, celebrity all-star game. We talked about Terrell Owens jamming one home in one of these games. I can't imagine I wasn't paying attention. There's no way, right? <laughs> McGrady. Oh, Tracy. Oh, man. And he hugged Kevin Hart, rubbing salt in the wound on that facial. I've been tipped off that the Twins have switched jerseys right in front of our eyes because one of the Property Brothers had four fouls. Ah. Yeah. Smart thing. And nobody has seemed to notice here. Good coaching there by Drake. Yes.
DMAC tried a four-pointer that time. Off the mark, and we get a timeout. Things looking bleak for the Stars and Stripes. Kevin Hart with a lot to say. We'll have his counterpart, Coach Drake, on the other side of this. Two minutes to go. McGrady, yes. You've seen a lot of those, JB. Oh, yeah. Your former teammate. One of the great scorers in the history of the league, Tracy McGrady. And one of the worst scorers in comedy, Kevin Hart. You know, this reminds me of, you know, when, when Michael was trying to make a comeback and just didn't have it. With some of the greats like Kevin Hart, you can tell when it's time to hang it up. What an effort, though, to yeah. come off the bench. Two for nine. Come out of the coaching box. <laughs> 0 for 3 from 3. Uh, oh, technical foul on Drummond. Side out of bounds for Canada. T-Mac, another heat check. And uh, 2 of 9 in his 14 minutes. You just hope that he shows the requisite sportsmanship down the stretch with his team trailing. Oh, yeah, you can count on that. Grady with the left-handed three. Thirty-six seconds to go, and T Mac openly taunting Kevin Hart. Who would have ever thought it would end like this for the legend of celebrity games, Kevin Hart? They pass Sadekis for three, and that'll just about do it. This one is cooked, glazed, and sliced. James ends it, and Canada. We'll win it 74 to 64 in the end.